So today we're gonna to talk about how you can get a reseller's permit or a wholesaler's permit or a reseller's license, right? There's many different names for it. They're all, they all basically mean the same thing. Depending on your state, there's a different, obviously, name for it. But I'm gonna outline how you can get it today and how you can utilize it to make money flipping products from liquidation sites and wholesale sites back, whether it's on eBay, Poshmark, or Mercari and doing your own fulfillment, or if it's back on Amazon, okay? Now, keep in mind that before you can actually apply for a wholesale websites and you know liquidation websites, you must have a reseller's permit. And it's not difficult at all to get a reseller's permit. It's actually a very streamlined and fast process, okay? And you can do it all online. And what a reseller's permit basically allows you to do is buy products at wholesale prices, so pre-sales tax, hence you're getting a cheaper price, and you can profit more on the sale. Now, to get a reseller's permit, there's basically three overall steps, okay? So you wanna go to irs.gov, that's step one, and file for an EIN if you don't already have a, biz a business EIN, okay? And people always ask me, you know, what's an EIN if they're a beginner, right? Now, this isn't necessarily exactly what it is, but to put it in beginner terminology, it's basically like a social security number for your business, okay? Now, you don't need to have an LLC or an, actually business, or an actual business formed, although that is recommended. You don't need it. You can obviously file for an EIN as a sole proprietor, but just keep in mind that if you do obviously file for an LLC or turn your LLC into an S-Corp or something in the future for, you know, tax, for advantages tax-wise, then, what you wanna keep in mind is you do need to obviously file for a new EIN at that uh, point in time, okay? Now, step number two after you go to irs.gov and you actually file for your business EIN number is you wanna to go to your state website, so your state website, and use your EIN to then file for the reseller's permit within your state, okay? It's really that simple. And then step three is to use that reseller's permit, obviously, to then sign up to the wholesale and liquidation websites. That way you can make purchases and flip those products back online for a profit. It's really that simple, okay guys? It's not that hard, it's not that difficult of a process. That said, obviously everybody can find irs.gov and apply for the actual business EIN. That's simple, you can Google that. Now, if you need to find directions for your specific website, 888Lots actually has, which is one of my favorite liquidation companies, actually has an entire kind of uh, website post that's like super long that will outline this process for you more in depth. I linked it down in the description if you want that actual uh, URL to that site or you can actually just Google uh, 888 lots, how to get a reseller's permit or something very similar. And once you actually click on that link that pops up, it's gonna take you to a page that outlines all that for you. You can simply scroll down, click on your specific state, and it's gonna give you a detailed explanation on how to go to your state website, because obviously each state website's different. All the states go to irs.gov for the EIN, but each direct state has a different specific website and a different way to file to get your permit, okay? 